Welcome back, folks. We are going to do something today. I don't exactly know what yet. Uh, but uh, the first things that we're going to do is check on our uh, passenger lines here and see how they're doing. So here we're doing fine. But, uh, and in Virginia Beach, we're doing fine. But in uh, Frisco, we have quite a lot of people waiting quite a lot of people so I think we're gonna put another train on this commuter line uh, we're simply gonna clone it once and then that'll be it hopefully that'll help we'll let time pass a bit Okay, uh, so that's that. Then we have here, uh, over here, we have a lot on the Midland Olathe commuter. Uh, so Midland is down here. Uh, do we have a lot of people waiting here? Not really. Here, quite a lot. Uh, but this is the one where all the trains were backed up. So I think that will sort itself out. I hope. Where are all the trains now? So here comes one. There's one. It's full. And we have one in here, one up here, one down here, and one here. Hopefully this will sort itself out. Uh, the others are looking okay. Murrieta Provo commuter. Hmm. Murrieta Provo commuter. So there are quite a lot of people here. What about down in Provo? Nothing really, but we did just pick up. But only 19. So I think we're going to leave that as is for now. Hundred and thirty-six now here. I think it's fine. Hopefully. Hopefully. All right. Uh, let's see here. Murrieta to Macula commuter. Six hundred and twelve people down here. Only 17. And up into Macula. Quite a lot of people as well. So here we can do with another train. That's a spine stake hauler. That's a spine cargo hauler. We're yet to Macula commuter. Let's add a train to that. To Macula, Memphis, someone is picking up at the moment. And I actually got quite a lot of people on board. 69. Alright. 604. Wanting to go to Timacula. Uh, 78. I think maybe we could do another train on this. Or what if we edited it? It's good. Um, what if we put another wagon on here? It's 
still good. Goes a little bit slower. Oh, what? Let's just do that. All right, so that's that done. Okay, new buses, new ships. Very cool. All right, then we have Memphis to Madison, 209. 352, only five wanting to go to Madison. And here. Memphis, Madison, 259. So we could definitely do with an extra train on that. That's a stake hauler. That's another hauler. That's another hauler. There's a passenger train. All right. So that's fine. Up here. Uh, Madison Omaha commuter. That looks absolutely fine. And so does this. Okay. Good. So. Uh, I also noticed down here that this actually only produces a maximum of 600. And our... Rate is 1,074, so that's a waste. Um, so there are 10 on there. Let's sell three. All right, what's your rate now? 748, that's still a bit high. All right, 637, that's about perfect. And you could actually do with some more uh, grain. So what we could do is hook this farm up and send it over. I kind of want to go through the mountain, I think. Um... Hmm. Another option is to simply hook up a new truck route to town and get grain going down here somehow. But uh, as was mentioned, I had a suggestion that our cargo spine tracks so for the fluid the stake and the uh, box uh, spine hauler lines maybe should be turned into four and i think that's probably a good idea it might be something that i do most of off camera because it's basically just pulling lines right and in some places it's going to be a little tricky to, to, to get an extra stop in but that's something that we'll have to figure out but in some places it's not a big problem to get another stop in but for instance here that's a little problematic to be honest all right so, but I think what I want to do now is hook up some things. So for instance, here we have a tools factory. Why not get that going down here and drop so that we can drop off planks and make tools here. Because, I mean, we are getting tools, but we're not fulfilling everything, right? So, so why not do that? And I think we will. 
So let's do that. And then we'll have a building cargo. And we really just need one stop here. I think we'll go with a standard truck station. Uh, with, I guess with two platforms actually. No, with one platform. So get that in there. And then let's have a look here. We need another truck stop here. Let's use this one. Make it 50 meters. Uh, do we have anything else here? We have this, but this could be easily just hooked up direct. But then we have this. So I think, yeah. Uh, town. Um, I think, whoa. Wrong button. Wrong button. Um, I think we'll do like this. And get this in here. Maybe over here. So it's not right next to the other one. Uh, we will do a wall around. We'll do lighting and footpath connections. And no, no footpath connections. We'll stick that in there. And we'll make a street. That goes straight in there. I really don't like this. This does not look okay. But it is what it is. Alright. We have a road depot here. We need a new line. From there. To there. And we will make it... That color. Uh, I don't really want you going that way, to be honest, in through town. Yeah, if that's what it wants. So this will be spine blanks to Frisco tools to spine yeah and we'll buy some vehicles cargo I think we'll go with the Kenworths uh, so it's not the logging truck we want it's the uh, this one that can do planks and tools and how many do we want 10 make you a color and put you on spine planks to frisco tools to spine And you know what? I think spines, planks, Frisco tools. Um, I'll put a waypoint uh, in here. 
And after Frisco Exchange, we'll go there. I think that's better. Let's take a look at our new trucks. Uh, they're so hard to... You know what? It's easier to just do this when it's trucks. But I do like the truck. It looks good. It looks good. Okay. This is nice. We actually have some planks sitting here waiting to be picked up for some reason. Okay, that's that. Ooh, we have a fuel refinery there, but the oil sand is all up at the other end of the map. What I do think I want to do is grab some of this and take over there. So let's build roads for that. Um, we'll start by upgrading this. Let's just upgrade it all the way. Don't know where it goes. It goes up there. Okay. Um, we'll upgrade that. And then I think we'll come in here. All right. Just have it a little bit uh, wavy, like a, a country road normally is. At least in Denmark, a country road is normally a little bit bendy. I know in the US they have long, long, long straight lines, but we, we don't have that in Denmark. But I suppose we are playing on a US map, so we could have. I don't mind that tunnel there. Right. Let's level this out a bit. Okay. And we need a couple of truck stops. So... We could do this one here. Do that. Uh, you can produce six hundred. And we'll just use I actually think we'll use you. We only need one terminal. What I'll do is something like this, I think. And then put a street in like that. Ooh, that's... That was a big hill, but this is fine. All right. Okay. I think that's okay. And then we need some vehicles. And I also had a comment that it's really annoying that I, that I zoom in and out when it's not needed. I am sorry about that. If if that annoys everyone, 
it's a force of habit. I will try to give it up. Uh, new line. From there to there. Uh, let's make you that color. You will be Yonkers. Um, coffee berries to beans. Then we need a new line from there to there. You shall be this color and you shall be Yonkers uh, coffee beans to spine. Now I hope the coffee beans don't go in dump trucks. Uh, so let's see. So no, this is beans. Good. Uh, but it's not berries. Oh, it's berries too. I would have thought that the berries went into the dump trucks, kind of. All right. Well. We'll buy. Um, let's try six. Um, and Yorkers coffee berries to beans. And then the other one needs a lot more. But, well, let's actually try six as well. Because we only need a rate of 300 on it. Uh, Yonkers, beans to spine. Okay. Oh, I am going to zoom here because I want to see the trucks and see what the estimated rate is. 654. That's kind of perfect. And then we need a rate of 300 on the other ones. 225. All right. 300. That couldn't be much more perfect. Okay. And are you producing beans now? Or berries? You are. Outstanding. So that's some more food production. Now what do we need paper for? Let's take a look at our industries. And look at requirement. Uh, paper. Nothing needs paper. Seriously, nothing needs paper? Yeah, there. Uh, Goods could do with paper. Okay. Okay. And what produces waste? What produces waste? Nothing. And how do I get waste to a... So, you want waste. But there's nothing that produces it. 
I don't get that. If you know how that works, then let me know. Let me know. All right. Now we were going to do a little bit of line maintenance because we have, for instance, a mogul still running, which is a, uh, whoa, that wasn't on purpose, which, which we really don't need. All right, the trucks are getting there. And I think it's over here that we have the mogul running, not there. Is it on this line? Yeah. The mogul. <laughs> um, so you have 15. What? Wait, what, what bars do you have? You only have fluid. All right. Well, I think we'll go with the big boy. And cargo. And you can't do fluids. So it's these tank cars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16 and we'll make you yellow all right so that's updated we also have this one i think this is a mogul as well oh that's a mikado but I think we're going to replace it as well. Also with a big boy. And then I think we'll probably try some of these. So front. Uh, one, two, four, five, six. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Let's do that. Do that. Do that. And do that. Capacity of 420. Wow. And it's only 260 meters. Well, we'll do it. I want to see that. Oh, we need to color it as well, maybe. Oh, like that. That is pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah. I don't think we're going to color it. But I like it. Yeah, that looks really nice. It's like containers on board. Just going to pick something up. Yeah, some food. Okay. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, a mask container. That's a Danish company. And I don't know what that other container is. But that is really cool. I like that. I like that a lot. 
Oscar. I like that a lot. Quite a lot of berries. Why do you have beans? Okay. Now, I think... What are we going to do in the next one? I am kind of thinking that we're going to continue our spine up to Concord and Tulsa. And then to Mesquite and Aveline, because then we have our spine all the way. And I think that would be kind of nice. So that we have completed our spine and we just need to manage the trains. And get an extra set of tracks for the spine lines as well, I think. So we have three spine lines now. We'll have one more in a, a hopper hauler. So that'll be four spine lines. So it would be pretty perfect to have four stations and four uh, tracks. So it would be 202 lines on each track. And I think that would work pretty good. Because it is true that it, it is getting a bit crowded at the moment. The spine line. And that would also mean that we can really start hooking up all these industries up here. Hooking out all the towns in, which I think would be good. I think that would be really good. Get all this going, all of it. I think that would be very useful. So yeah, that's the plan for next time. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.